All right, the same person who asked me to talk about the whole Shazam, Billy Baston, uh, Chicken His Own Coming Book or not, also asked me to talk about Cyborg. Talk about should Cyborg be a part of the Justice League or should Cyborg be a part of Teen Titans? And I, for one, say that he should be full on, full on a part of Teen Titans. I get why they put Cyborg a part of the Justice League. You know, you gotta have that one black face that's out there. Not black face like the white people painting their face black. Just like, you gotta have that black person on one team. Like, it always happens. Unless it's X-Men. Then, no, Storm. Storm's part is a black face in the X-Men. There's not one for the Fantastic Four because there's only four of them. But I guess you can say Ben Grimm be the black face of the Fantastic Four. There's always one black face in comic books. So, and that black face for the Justice League has to be it has to be Cyborg around there. I guess they don't want Jon Stewart or Vixen to be that one black character. I think Vixen can be the best fucking filth or seventh wheel to any Justice League, uh, Justice Society team. But Teen Titans need Cyborg. They gotta have that Kilowog. They gotta have that Kilowog character to like, train all the new Teen Titan characters, all the new Teen Titan like memories, uh, inductees. Inductees are part of the group, but they, they usually die and they have a little basement or all their tombstone where they're all buried But he does train them to die pretty much so like all most of the new Teen Titans are pretty much red shirts Just letting you guys know that right now most of the Teen Titans are red shirts because they die a lot Like a lot a lot It's something I never really thought of before Teen Titans is a lot like the Legion of Superheroes it's just Legion of Superheroes is more of a, they don't need adults to look over them. They pretty much do what the hell they want to do, even though they're kids. Never even thought about that before. But yeah, Cyborg should definitely be a part of Teen Titans. I can't do Teen Titans right now because Superboy, huh, Superboy. Superboy is weird, man. Like in this new 52, Superboy weirds the living hell out of me. I do not like this new Cyborg, like Superboy at all. Because back in like the 90s, Superboy came out after Superman died, and Superboy was like a cocky, arrogant bastard. But then he found out Luthor was like part of his body, and that made him go freaking crazy. Absolutely crazy. And he saw like, like him future self. He saw like Superboy from the future, and he was a freaking megalomaniac. It was, uh,. It was good writing for Superboy back then. This new stuff now is a lot like the Young Justice cartoon show. And that Superboy worked for that TV show. It does not work for continuity of a character who's been around for 20 years who got a lot of death inside of him. It just, it doesn't fit. It doesn't fit well for it. It's just, it's weird now seeing him like that. And the same thing for Wonder Girl. She's like, she's like all sexual and shit. Blah. That's not a Cassie. That's not, that's, I don't know. That's, no, I just, no. The Cassie I remember was a, was a nerd, man. She was a nerd who got pretty, but she was still a nerd inside. Just, just no, man. Just no. Just, anything, just, you know, all new stuff sucks. I sound like a fucking old man right now, but just, New 52 sucks. Dan Dito, he fucking blows, man. He fucking, he's fucking everything up. Fucking it all up. It's like we had a good shit going. I was getting my fucking individuals every fucking week. My Supergirl, my Teen Titans. I was getting my fucking Superman. mon -El was gone. Like fucking Cal came back. It was getting awesome again. Everything was getting awesome. Like Batman was doing like some cool shit because he just came back. Hanging out with fucking Damien. But Batman Incorporated kind of fucking sucked. I don't care what you guys say, Incorporated was fucking blue. I don't like Incorporated. It was pretty much Iron Man, but with Batman. That's what that's what Batman Incorporation was. Blah. No thank you. But yeah. Cyborg should be a part of Teen Titans. I if they change Superboy around and stop making Cassie a fucking sexual fucking icon, I may go back to reading Teen Titans. And yeah. I can't even read Justice League anymore. I try reading Justice League. I try like collecting like collecting the first ten issues. Like, ugh, this is bad. I don't like any of this. Only the only good thing about this story is the art. So thank you, Jim Lee, for making art fucking beautiful. But did you write this piece of shit too? Because this is fucking terrible. Ugh. Okay. You guys have fun. 
take it easy. Um, yeah. <laughs>